the right atrium forms the right border, right part of the sternocostal surface, part of the base of the heart also, part of the base of the heart also. Okay, it forms the base of the heart, right border of the heart, sternocostal surface of the heart. Also part of the superior border of the heart. Part of the superior border of the heart. That's what the right atrium's contribution is. This is your long question. Right atrium. Now when we open the right atrium, okay, now suppose uh, when we draw this heart like this, there is the superior vena cava here, inferior vena cava here, and we cut open and unfold it. So when we cut open, we take a cut and open it like this. Of this may as a cut cut this one. As you open it. So now what you see here is the anterior wall of the right atrium. <coughs> so what we see is in the anterior wall, now I have cut it open like this and reflected here. So what, was, what I am drawing here is the anterior wall. At the starting point of the anterior wall, I see this structure called as <coughs> crista terminalis. Crista terminalis running from the SVC to IVC downwards. SVC to IVC downwards. And starting from the crista terminalis, we see uh, rather I would say no need to even make it so zigzag also. You can just draw it like this. <coughs> Musculi so this is the rough part of the heart. Why do you need rough part? Rough part is developed from the primitive atrial chain. Why do you need rough part? Why there are speed breakers on the road? So every chamber of the heart is going to have a rough part and a smooth part. Smooth part will be outflowing because you want the blood to flow out. Okay. So this is crista terminalis. This is musculi pectinati. Musculi pectinati. Together, crista terminalis plus musculi pectinati is equal to rough anterior wall of right atrium. This kind of terminal is plus muscular activity is equal to rough anterior wall of right atrium. Now let's study the smooth portion. The smooth portion is this. Okay? The smooth portion is this. And also the interatrial septum. So once we talk about the anterior wall, the two is this smooth portion running from SVC to IVC actually. And then <coughs> see the left atrium is here, the left atrium is like this. The four pulmonary veins are opening into the left atrium. And the left atrium is like this, veins are opening like this. So, anterior wall of the left atrium is the interatrial septum. Is the 